I'm just gonna show you guys. This is the bulk of wheat. Don't look at it and say uh because I know half of you guys go to Turkish restaurants and you do eat it without knowing, okay? <laughs> dinner to make like it's not going to take long for you to prep everything it's not going to take time at all all right so and also quarantine you don't want to be eating heavy all the time you don't want to be on your rice fufu panda jam banku you don't want to be on that all the time you know you want to be on something light okay so i'm going to show you guys another alternative of rice and yeah that's about it let's show let me show you how i make my fish my quick fish soup with some boga wheat all right so stay tuned and keep watching so first and foremost start off with my hands are so dry i've washed my hands so they are very dry okay so i'm just going to show you guys this is the boga wheat don't look at it and say uh because i know half of you guys go to turkish restaurants and you do eat it without knowing okay it looks like couscous yeah it's very nice so i'm just gonna wash it the same way you wash your rice you just want to wash that scrub, scrub, scrub. So in here, I've got a cup and a half, yeah? And my water is about, it's quite a lot of water because I don't like my boga wheat too hard. I like it quite soft. So, the next thing is, let me just move this out of the way. The next thing what I like to do is just put some Maggi, chicken Maggi cube. Ew, look how dry I'm <laughs> So I'm just going to put some chicken maggi cube, one, you want to season it up, okay, oh, this one's hard, yo, come on, break through, okay, I'm just going to dump that in there and watch it, separate it once it gets a little bit, so yeah, we're adding a bit of salt, just a tiny bit, sprinkle a bit of salt, and a little bit of oil all right now that's done just gonna mix it up i want to add a bit of flavor enhancer in it too i want it tasting yummy like scrumptious <laughs> so yeah mm, finish with that Close it up. I'm just going to turn on my cooker. Move this out of the way. So, now that's cooking, yeah? Mm. The next thing is, so I've got to drink my juice. Mm. Yum. yum 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 so this is the fish i'm going to be using today i sliced it cleaned it all nice okay this fish i only know it in lingala like it's called malangwa in it so it's called malangwa so that is the fish that is the fish i'm gonna be using today and i've got all my stuff that i'm gonna be putting into my fish and uh, yeah now let's slice up some mixed peppers you've got the red one yellow and green so i'm gonna slice up those first i'll do my i'll do my onion last because yeah i want to be tearing up okay So 
go. Just slice it up. Guys, how's your quarantine going? Like, have you guys picked up like new recipes? What have you learned to cook? You know? Because now you have time. All the time in the world to learn how to cook. My next goal is this is just something simple. I'm not learning. I know what I'm doing. But my next goal. I've been thinking that I want to learn how to make some cupcakes. I know. I know. You must be thinking, girl, it's so easy. No, I burn my cupcakes, okay? I want to make it to perfection. <laughs> so you just want to slice it up, not too small. So yeah, I just want to learn how to make some cupcakes. How to do some cupcakes and then I want to like cupcakes, cookies, you know, those little things. Like, obviously, I've got a child now, I think it'll be so fun to do it with them. I find it, I find it cute when parents do things like that with their kids. So, that's what I'm gonna do. I'll probably do the next, I'll do it next week. You know, I'm going to start off with the ready mix yeah the ready mix one you know the um, ready mix flour and all of that jazz I'm going to start off with that first before I go and waste my money okay <laughs> so what's your goals like you guys tell me what's your goals for 2020 being at home quarantine <laughs> what do you guys do oh this is celery I want to write up the English word. I'll search it up. But this is silly. Like, you can drink this. You can blend it and drink it. Yo, English is not my first, my second, and my third language. It's not. Okay, so bear with me. I've been in this country long enough. <laughs> but, yeah. I only know what I want to. <clears throat> but, anyways... That sounds a bit dumb, but anyway, I'm being real in it. Your girl is being real. But yeah, I love this. It smells so good in your food, like especially with veg and stuff. Oh, especially when you're making an um, okra soup. Now I'm just slicing some spring onion. All of these things, I'm gonna fry it all at once. So I'm just slicing them up. I'm not a professional chef, so don't judge me with my cutting. In the meantime, while I'm cutting that, let me let me heat up the pan because I need it for the oil. I need the oil to be hot. Okay, I feel like I did sprinkle a bit too much. Oh, that's a lot. Okay, yeah, that's fine. So, I've got about, can you guys see? This pot is hot, boy. So, I just put a little bit of oil because this fish, once you cook it, it does get oily. It's a bit oily, it has its natural oil, so you don't really need to put too much oil. And this is just a quicker way of making this fish. There's also another way. If you guys want to know that, I do make the grill way as well. We can do that next, when I'm having next. But in the meantime, I'm just going to sprinkle some chicken jumbo seasoning, which I'm, I was supposed to do a while ago. Just let it sit on the fish for a little bit. Okay, just let that sit 
while we are cooking and the fish cooks very quickly it cooks very quickly so you don't really want to put that on first we're pouring all of this inside the hot oil coming I'm just stirring it all. Just doing some stirring. But right now, I'm going to add some flavor enhancer, which should look like this. Just adding two spoons of that. spoons of jumbo chicken and some aromat just sprinkle sprinkle some ground garlic uh, ginger just a little bit and then sprinkle some ground um, garlic powder one more thing my favorite is this cube right here this cube right here this is from France I love this I'll show you this cube I'm just gonna put one of these it gives me that lemon nice taste like I don't know how to describe it bro but it's nice sounding so ghetto yeah so I'm just gonna stir that let it steam up fry whatever it wants to do This looks so juicy. I know you all you more people will eat it like this, but us, sorry, we don't want it to be crunchy for this recipe, okay? We want it all melted. As you can see, the bulgur wheat is pretty much doing great. It's doing great, doing great. Getting there, getting there. Well done, Shadow. Get it. obviously made a hole and I thought I should show you guys this is the half way I do have a tin opener but this is a habit okay I grew up without it and I'm not gonna use it <laughs> okay so this is my chopped tomatoes Sainsbury's value come in a little bit soft so we won't put tomato in there as well. My mom would have screamed, no! Why? Go and go dick. That's my mom for you. She's not a fan of tomatoes. So she tin ones. She likes the fresh ones. But she don't like tomato sauces and that. But this is my house, mom. This is my house, my cooking. Alright. So Mm. so we're just gonna let that simmer let it cook up a little bit we don't want to, uh, the tomato to be in gai if you're Congolese you should know what I'm saying you don't want your tomato to go in gai okay wait to be in gai in your sauce you want it to properly cook gai means sour so you don't want your tomatoes to be sour okay so you want it to be properly cooked and then I'll pour in my fish when I feel like it's almost there because the fish doesn't take long to cook correct in the meantime i need to find the lid girl you was not prepared 
time. I'm just gonna close it up. Let that simmer. Let it cook. Ah, mama, nangaya naziki. Naziki, naziki, naziki. Ah. Right, anyways. There's my burger wheat. It's cooking up, cooking up, looking fine. Get lost in the sauce, all right? Let's move on. Right now, our sauce is looking delicious, it's looking tantalizing. I'll show you guys. The veggies are looking nice and moist, got good moisture. So, I'm just gonna pour this in there. Make sure. I'm gonna stir it because I know once I cover it, once I cover this, I can't use this to stir because it's gonna break my fish. All right, and I don't wanna have broken fishes, okay? Okay, so I'm just gonna add a bit of water, just a little bit. I don't want my sauce to be too runny today. And along the way, if I want to add any seasoning, I will. But as for now, this is what we're doing, okay? I think it's cooked. Let me get, get a little spoon here. Mm. Yeah. That is cooked. So it looks like. But yeah, that's about it. Do you know what? Yeah. If, listen, let me give you guys a little motivation, right? If you wanted to start a YouTube channel and you always wanted to start a YouTube channel, do it now because people are at home and they are watching. Promote it everywhere. You've got Instagram, you've got Facebook, you've got Snapchat you've got tiktok you've got twitter promote it send it to your friends send it to your family and be like repost it do you get what i mean start now it can be cooking what i'm doing what you're watching right now it can be cooking i'll watch it you send it to me i'll watch it i'll definitely watch it mm -hmm. like that's what you gotta do what are you doing while you're on quarantine you're probably exercising um you're reading um you can talk about the book you're reading about you're watching a movie and you really liked it you can do a review on it uh what else you're going through your clothes you're decluttering your house you're decluttering your clothes you're, you're film it you've got your phone film it if you haven't got no light do it during daylight during the day film it um if you want to amazon are still doing deliveries i'm gonna link where i got my ring light from it's from amazon amazon are still doing their deliveries get your ring light you've got 40 quid to spare 50 quid to spare get your ring light film it um you want your funny person you're a motivational speaker on the day on your as your daily job or you know how to advise people sit down and talk you can do anything if you're a good eater you know about good food you can cook good food you want to sit down and talk while you're eating go ahead do mukbang is it mukbang or mukbang <laughs> film it okay <laughs> i go by is do you want to make sure you're happy i don't want to i don't want my daily job to be okay i'm waking up i'm angry i'm frustrated i don't want to go to work but i have to go to work for the money no it has to be something you love okay Well, my fish to break okay this is what i do you can do this with your lid closed but this is what i do i just stir it like that are you guys hungry yeah. okay time to dish up are you hungry you're hungry yes anna's hungry you are hungry time for you to cook your own <laughs> I'm a special presentation up in here, and this is how we eat. So don't get offended if you're a chef, okay? If you work in a high class restaurant, you're not going to be offended. Okay, 
last restaurant. Do you know what your friend did? I don't know, this girl can look pretty. Turn it off. That's his portion. No, this is mine. Mine and Anna's. We share. Yeah, I think that's enough because I'm not that hungry. Hi! Guys. This is the packaging for Gold of the Week. I forgot to show you. I hope you guys enjoy that it's just a quick cooking vlog hope you guys enjoyed it and yeah cook your own if you know how to cook if you know how to wrap up noodles if you know how to make noodles rich fancy whatever it is that you cook mashed potato whatever it is like cook up okay the people behind me are saying they're hungry so i want to speak to you guys later do you comment like share and subscribe i shall see you guys on my next video peace Did enjoy this video.